This is Mark Bedore with the Garden Grove TV3 News Report. That's it. I cannot say anything. I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be here in my own apartment. For the first time in her life, Karima Nazi has her own apartment. The Afghanistan native, who came to the U.S. 25 years ago, is among the first residents of Wesley Village in downtown Garden Grove. I can afford it and I'm so happy. Wesley Village is 47 units of affordable housing, of one to three bedroom apartments, including 16 units reserved for seniors. But this unique campus also houses the Boys and Girls Club, Head Start, daycare for both adults and children, services for Alzheimer's patients, even a free medical clinic available to anyone who walks in. They'll be able to see a doctor, we can order blood tests, we'll give prescriptions, help them get specialty care if they need it. So we have a well-connected network to be able to provide services to those that need help in this community. And so we have multiple layers of services components that will be offered here for the residents, but also offered for those that live in the community and are seeking out services. They can come right in here and get help. First conceived about five years ago, Wesley Village is a unique public-private partnership built by the nonprofit Jamboree Housing Corporation in collaboration with the city of Garden Grove, using state and federal funds and tax credits plus private financing all built on land leased from the Garden Grove United Methodist Church. Oh, it's so wonderful. It's beyond our imagination. It's, we are so blessed that this come into being, that we can serve the community and serve the poor and the elderly in our community. Wesley Village is also providing new office space to help the nonprofit Project Hope Alliance where we will be meeting with homeless families with school-aged children so that we can find out how to move them out of homelessness into permanent housing, as well as work with the kids through our education programs to find out how we catch them up in school. It's really a catch-all effort for this collective impact to provide services, housing, and really keep Garden Grove and Orange County strong. There's lots of amenities at Wesley Village, a playground, exercise equipment, and a computer room, just to name a few. And those who qualify to live here will only have to spend 30% of their income on rent. That means they'll have some spending money. This means a lot to Garden Grove, and particularly here in the downtown area, which we've been actively reimagining for the last several years. So it's great to see new, fresh new bodies come into this area to help support all the restaurants on Main Street. It's a life that Karim Nazi could never have imagined back in Afghanistan. I'm so happy, and thank you for America. In what may be a sign of how much housing like this is needed, all of the apartments have already been leased. This is Mark Bedore reporting.